All right, you guys, I closed the top because it was gonna start spilling over. Hey guys, welcome back to Toy Caboodle. Today I'm gonna be doing a do-it-yourself lava lamp. How cool is this? I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make this with just simple everyday household items that you might have. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need vegetable oil, you're gonna need a glass container, you're gonna need some Alka-Seltzer tablets, and you're gonna need some food coloring. And so what you wanna do is you wanna fill up your glass container that you have with vegetable oil up until right about there. Three-fourths of the way with vegetable oil. So let's go ahead and do that. I hope I have enough. You guys, next we're gonna fill this up with water. All right, you guys, so I do have some water here. It is room temperature. And we are gonna fill this up until about an inch away from the top. And as you can see there, I left a little bit of spacing. All right, you guys, I had to zoom my lens out a little bit because I want you guys to see the whole reaction, how this actually happens. So then I have my Alka-Seltzer tablets and I have my food coloring. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add about five drops of food coloring. Or maybe I'll add a little more. Just like that. All right, you guys, let me screw on my food coloring before I get that everywhere. All right, next you have your Alka-Seltzer tablets. And really, you just need one tablet, but you have to break it up into pieces. So, looks like there's two in a package. We're just gonna take one out, and I'm gonna break it up into some pieces, just like that. And let's see if this works. There it goes. So cool! And that creates your lava lamp. I think that's so awesome. And I really wonder if it really matters how many of these you add in there. There they go. Let's see what happens. I think it'll get really busy. Oh, that's so awesome. Maybe I should close the top. Yeah. All right, you guys, I closed the top because it was gonna start spilling over. So cool, you guys. Um, let me know how it turns out. If you do it, I really like this color um, in my lava lamp. Let's see if we can spin it down. That's so awesome. All right, you guys, I had so much fun making this lava lamp. This is going definitely going into my room. I really want to learn how to make the glow-in-the-dark lava lamp, and maybe I will do that in another video. But if you guys love these do-it-yourself videos, leave me a comment down below and tell me what you want to see or what you want me to do. And you guys, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. All right, you guys, stay sweet. Talk about it.